So the way the three speed scale exercise works is like this. We are going to choose a single beat to put on our metronome. For beginners, you'll probably choose something like 65, 70. Um, I'm choosing a kind of lower side 80, which would be for this, just as an example, when I play this exercise when I'm warming up, um, it's usually at something like 120 or 125. And what we're going to do with this beat is we are going to subdivide it with our scale playing in multiple different ways. We are first going to play two octave scales in eighth notes. Then we're going to play three octaves of triplets. And finally, we're going to play four octaves of sixteenth notes. Now, we end up working on three main things with this exercise, doing it like this. First, and, and definitely of greatest importance, is we learn accuracy and confidence with subdividing our beat. Um, you will learn to switch between the different subdivisions, the different note values, eighth notes, triplets, and sixteenth notes, very, very effectively when you do this right. If you are not doing it right, you'll get off with the beat, um, and you will know it very quickly. So that's definitely the first primary thing that we're working on. Secondly, as you might guess, we are going up as many octaves as we have subdivisions. So two for eighth notes, three for triplets, four for sixteenth notes. We are learning to span up and down the keyboard, um, learning to play effectively up and down the registers of the keyboard. It's a very quick, effective way to take what was probably two octaves max for you practicing up to much more so. So you work on that. And finally, despite it being in the name of the exercise, um, we it's more of a happy coincidence, we'll call it, than an actual goal, though it is an objective. Um, we get faster, right? That's how music generally works, is that if you really want to get faster at a certain point, you can only take the beat so fast it makes more sense to subdivide it, um, though of course there are exceptions to that. Um, some forms of jazz very justifiably have very fast beats, for example, but for the most part, getting faster entails more subdivisions. So that's basically it. Um, it's a relatively simple concept, but you do need to keep those three things in mind as you are doing it because it can kind of get a little bit easy um, to neglect one or the other as you're doing it. And it's also going to be very, very important um, that you have your sense of rhythm really locked in before you get started playing. Um, a great mistake I see um, in many, many students who try and do this is that they start thinking about the beat with their fingers before they have thought about it effectively with their brain. So the first thing to do once you've chosen your beat, like I said, for this lesson, I chose a nice mellow 80 to demonstrate with. Let me go ahead and put on my metronome here. What I'm going to do before I even start is get my subdivided rhythms, right? So we're starting with eighth notes. Moving to triplets. And finally, going to 16th notes. So when you're playing the scale, you're going to be expected, um, expected by the metronome, I guess, to very, um, to really work on transitioning very swiftly, going first from eighth notes to triplets to 16th notes. You'll get very good at that. Great practice for that. Um, and so as long as you have that rhythm aspect of it nailed down, this exercise becomes much more effective for us to work on. Thanks for watching this lesson from Liberty Park Music. If you enjoyed this lesson and learned something from it, do us a favor, hit that like button. And if you really liked it, share it around. Let your friends and family check it out too. If you want to find more lessons like this or explore other piano-related topics, please come visit us at libertyparkmusic.com. We have full piano courses ranging from beginner to more advanced levels, and everything is online and streaming 24-7 so that you can design your music learning around your schedule and learn in the comfort of your own home from a talented roster of professional teachers and musicians. Come check us out.